Okay everyone, today we're going to fix my mom's broken nail. So before you go and chop off your nails, try this. See if this will focus better here. So I'm going to show you, see her nail is pretty banged up right here. There we go, see that? And also her thumb has a little bit of a break right here. Right there. So today we're going, I'm going to show you a technique that we do. She found this great product at Fred Meyers right here called Nail Bandages. And before I was just doing the, um, putting the nail glue on, buffing it out, nail glue, buff, nail glue, buff. And it seemed to work, you know, eventually it gunks up. She works at her, at a computer. And so she is constantly typing so they can get <clears throat> bent pretty easily. And then I have this right here, which is a basic nail glue. It's just basically like, what is it? What type of glue is that? Super. super glue. So it's just basically you can get super glue. This is cool because you can find this at beauty stores and it's and it has a brush on it. See, so it works out great for me. But you know you can use super glue and just use a toothpick. So I'm gonna start on this finger right here, and I hope you guys can see it. And I don't you know get in the way too much. So I have cleaned and buffed her nails. I've, I've given her um, a, you know, a manicure, somewhat cleaned all the nails, got the cuticles and buffed out her nails so that it's nice and clean, nothing's on it. I even went back over it with a towel just to make sure there's no extra residue on there from the lotion. So first thing I'm going to do is underneath her nail, I'm going to go ahead and put a little bit right underneath there. And I'm not going to buff that out because I don't, you know, can't reach it. So, just to give it a little bit more stability when I start working on the other end of it. Thank you. So, if um, the nail breaks further down, if the nail breaks further down and you can't do this, that's fine. We couldn't do this on her for a while either. Go underneath and put the glue underneath it. We couldn't do that for a while. So I'll let that dry. I'll do the same thing to the thumb. Yes, I got it on the skin, but eventually it comes off. And I guess for her, she's like, I don't care as so long as I can keep my nails. See, she has really pretty nails. Okay. So now we're going to go over the top here and it, you know, I'm going to try to get the brush in this way and in this way. Okay, so I'm going to go this way and this way and get some of that extra off there and just work it in there. Try not to get on the skin. I mean, it is inevitable, I guess, that a little bit gets on there. And I'm going to let that dry and head over to the thumb and do the same thing. This way. And this way. This way. Just brush it over. If you want to make sure the nail is um, even and level, just press down, you know, I'm, I don't press down too hard. I mean, if she wants to press it down harder, that's okay. But I don't know. I can't feel where her nail is going to bend, but she can. So she can um, bend it down um, further if she wants to. I am apprehensive about doing it hard also because I don't want my nail to stick to the glue. And then I can literally rip her nail off. So, Although, not necessarily her nails because they're super strong. Okay, so that's dry. Now I'm going to take my brush or excuse me, my file, I'm going to do side one. So it's basically, um, I don't know, excuse me, sorry. I don't know what level that is. It doesn't say, usually it says um, what grade that is. But basically it's just soft. So it can, you don't want it too coarse because it can really mess up the nail and everything like that. So we're just going to lightly go over this.
I might not be able to go inside of it again, but just to make sure, go ahead and do it. Like that. Thumb. Sorry about the lighting. Like that. Let it dry and keep buffing. Now that we've buffed it out and applied that three times, we're going to take this, open it up for you so you can see. It comes with um, an orange stick, a small one, but uh, I used it last time, it worked really well, but I think I might use my tweezers, and then it comes with a file. We didn't use the file. So it's these little pieces here. There you go, you can see those there. They come in different sizes. I'm gonna, so I'm gonna grab this large one right here for her. <clears throat> okay. Okay, so change of plans. We're gonna use this one because um, the break was larger and it needs to go all the way to the edge of the nail, so that right there. Right there. Take the orange stick and rub, rub, rub. Not too hard. Turn the orange stick around and just work it, work it. My phone's gonna die. And there's that. So you can see it's going crossways this way. And it's pretty secure. So now we're going to move on to the thumb. So literally, when she had, this had just broken, this nail, it broke down here. And then now the break is right there. So probably, I would say the next time I do her nails, I'm going to have to cut them. But, you know, that's okay. They're still super pretty. So I would just say, before you snap them off, try this technique. It works really well. I'm going to go ahead and paint her nails how she wants, and then I'll, I'll put a picture so you can see that you can't you can't tell that it was done all right okay